Welcome back to my channel. So today is Friday of Memorial Day weekend. I had half a day today at work. So I am I am just like hanging out until Matt's done with work and he's gonna pick me up and we're gonna do some stuff for the house. So I figured I'd vlog this weekend since we're just staying kind of local. The weather's supposed to be really nice this weekend but not necessarily warm down the beach where it's like a beach day. So we decided to stay up here. But um, yeah, today we're going to go to look at granite. We already picked out the granite for our kitchen island, but then decided we want to do it around our fireplace too. And they also have like our kitchen sink there. And then we're going to stop by the house today and like just hold up all these paint colors to the walls and just like figure that stuff out and then go to the mall to do some returns. And then Sunday we're going to go into the city. So yeah, I figured I'd vlog this weekend, but since I'm hanging around, I just got some clothes in from Isla Movement, so I wanted to try that on for you, and then I'm going to show you, um, I bought a bunch of stuff from Maritzia and some stuff I'm returning, so I figured I would show you that as well. Alright, okay, so from Isla Movement, there's this really comfy lounge set. This is the bralette and the sleeper short, both in size medium. It's so comfortable, the size medium, um, I'm definitely like, you know filling it out really well right now but I like how adjustable the straps are back here and it's just super stretchy so definitely something like I could actually sleep in and just lounge around I feel like this would be good for nursing too um and I can't believe how comfy these shorts are like I look at these shorts and think that the waistband would just be really tight but I literally don't even feel the waistband and they're so stretchy this is a size medium like i said and it fits perfectly and it's modal fabric so if you know that it's so comfortable like i definitely want to sleep in these shorts i might get the modal t-shirt too and just like wear this to bed <laughs> okay now we have the same bralette but a different color and now these are the new suzy shorts so if you've gotten her leggings or shorts before usually there's a top seam right here but this time there's no top seam, which I'm so happy about because now it won't dig in at all. I mean, this fabric's already so stretchy, but now that there's no top seam, it's even stretchier. So this is a size medium, which is actually what I would wear before being pregnant too. But now that there's no top seam, the medium still fits really well because there's absolutely like no restriction on my stomach. Again, I barely feel it on my stomach. So yeah, this is very comfortable and you can work out in these too. So she also gave me a matching workout tank. Okay, this is the Sends Out tank, again, size medium, and it fits perfectly. Um, and it's very supportive, yet super stretchy. So what I like about this is how there's no, like, bottom seam here that digs into you. Like, if you know the Lululemon Energy Bras or Line Bras, there's that bottom seam there, and it does dig into your waist, but this doesn't dig in at all, so it's very comfortable for me. And yeah, the size medium is perfect. So I'm actually going to do a workout probably tomorrow morning. So I think I'll wear this set because I have been working out at home. It's been like so nice out to do home workouts. So if I do, I'll definitely show that on here. But yeah, it's everything I got from Isla Movement. Now I'm going to show you Aritzia. Okay, so I got this linen set. This is the sail shirt and then the sail shorts. A size small on the top and size medium on the bottom. I tried the small bottoms, but the waistband isn't really that stretchy. Like... It stops right here, so the def the medium is definitely way more comfortable. And this is the Virginia tube top in a size large. So I actually ordered this online in a size medium, and it did make my boobs look really good, but it was just way too tight, and I could tell that like it was just gonna be way too tight as I got more pregnant. Like this large definitely has more room up here, but it's tight on the band right here, so it almost is just like feeling like a bandeau right now. And even though it's a little loose on top, I don't think it's going to fall over. So I think this is just more comfortable uh, to have for the summer. And I like it with this set and also another pair of pants I got that I'll show you. But yeah, I just think this is going to be a very comfortable set to have during the summer. And something I can wear after pregnancy too. And then these are the Copal pants in size medium. I don't have any pants right now that I can wear with my belly. So these are really comfortable again the waistband the size medium is perfect and it fits right underneath my belly and the pants themselves are just so comfortable like they're just aligning in them and it just feels so nice so this is just I feel like a cute summer outfit I can wear and the pants are the perfect length on me so just throw on some sandals or even some heels and I feel like I can wear this 
uh, when you go to Cape May or something. And this is the angel dress in size small. It's so comfortable. Again, so stretchy. I feel like from the front you can't even tell I'm pregnant. Something I could definitely wear after pregnancy too. And I just really like how comfortable this is. Again, I don't have to wear a bra or anything. And yeah, it's just a really light, cute summer dress. Like I might even wear this to the mall today. And then I also got this contour dress that has like ruching and size medium. I already wore it. I don't feel like putting it on again, but so comfortable. I'm really happy with this. If I would stick with the size that you get in the contour bodysuit. So I was a medium in, in that. And then I also got this um, lifestyle bra in a size medium from Ritzia, but I'm actually going to return it since, you know, I just got some stuff from Isla Movement anyway, so I don't really need this bra, I guess. And that was a size large, like I definitely wouldn't be able to wear that after pregnancy. And then, yeah, like I said, I got the shorts in a medium, so I'm going to return that. The tube top I got in um, a size medium, so I'm returning it. I got it in white and coffee beans, so i got to return those. And this top I had in small already, but I wanted to try the medium, but I actually am fine with the small, so I'm returning this top as well. Also, back in like early April, I got this dress from Ritzia. It's the lover dress, I think it's called, in a size small. And um, I was like, wow, I could wear this all pregnancy. But now I like don't really fit into the top. Like it's really squeezing my boobs. So... I don't know what to do because I really like this dress. It's obviously too late to return it and I'm sure my boobs will be different um, after breastfeeding and stuff in the way future, but I don't know if this like looks weird because I would wear this to the mall with like sneakers or something because I really like this dress and it's comfortable except for how much it's squeezing my chest. So I'm gonna figure out what to wear. Okay, here's what I decided on for the mall. This dress is old from Aritzia, but it's so comfortable. I'm very light, has a nice little slit, sandals from Dolce Vita, and then my YSL bag. So, yeah, Okay, granite was really quick. We're doing the same as our kitchen island, but here's house progress. Final window is in. All right, here's the house status. Walls are primed. Trim's gonna go in next week. Kitchen starts going next week. Tile, so that's why we're figuring out paint colors. But then here's some stains. We're gonna start talking floor stains. We're gonna stain the door deep walnut. Um, but yeah, that's already too dark. I don't know if we wanna do something more trendy, something more neutral. I have no idea. Okay, we decided we're gonna ask for another sample like weathered oak, maybe one that's even lighter. But this is cool, but it's just a little too trendy. So something like weathered oak, maybe lighter if he has it. Like in looking at this here, gray is the color that we had at Autumn Way. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But just too gray. Okay. That's what mm -hmm. the website said, that's what the consultant yeah. said. So we're doing this for the master in our dining room. Yeah. Because we didn't want anything too blue, but this is kind of like what we had in our old room. It looked good. Okay, so now for the foyer, we're going to do Gray Owl, which is what our builder usually does. And he was going to do that throughout the whole house, but we decided we're going to do something different in the living room area. So we're going to do Collingwood, which I don't have in here, but basically it's just like a warmer gray. And then in the kitchen, I think we're going to do what's called a classic gray, which I also don't have because our backsplash is like a warm, like it's like an ivory... Uh, subway tile and gray owl does come kind of greenish so we think the classic gray will look a little bit better in here and then same in the bedrooms I'm not wearing his paisley <laughs> i like that okay this is what i came to lulu for i really want to try the v-neck bra i don't know how that's gonna look with my chest right now and i really like the lip gloss color it's annoying me they're double lined I still want to try them. And I know I have strawberry milkshake, but this new like meadow color is so pretty. This isn't doing justice. And I really want to try the line dress, but I doubt I'll be able to fit in it. I'm a size 8 in a line tank, so that's what I'm going to try, but we'll see if my belly fits. Okay, actually I really like this and the bra works really well with my chest right now. This is a size 8, which I have been sizing up to an 8 even before I got pregnant. Uh, it's just more comfortable, fully covered here. This color is amazing. Um, and then the double line, I size up to a six, and I actually think it's fine. I don't 
it's not bothering me at all. I don't know if it's just because I'm pregnant, but um, I think I'm gonna get it. The only thing I'm noticing for this bra is it does like look a little bunchy right there, like when I pose. I don't know why it looks bunchy. I think it's because it's like double lines. Like that's kind of annoying me, but I still really like this bra. Okay, and then of course, I really love this pink. I'm sure it's so similar to Shower Milkshake, but I think I'm gonna buy it and compare it when I get home, because this is just like my color. Okay, I love the dress, and it actually fits so well, and it's so comfortable. I love how the shorts are like detachable, so comfy, but I think I'd rather get this after pregnancy since it's, it's expensive. And um, yeah, I'd rather just get it when I'm not like my pregnancy size and see what size I am. All right, Lulu's done. Today is the grand opening of the Aloe Yoga store in the Garden State Mall, so we're gonna check that out. This is kind of like Lulu's lip gloss color. If I wasn't pregnant, I would buy this. All right, it is now the next morning. We ended up just meeting some of my family for dinner at Bear Burger. And yeah, now this morning it is about 10.30, I'm about to go to Matt's house and we're gonna take Paisley for a walk because Paisley's at his house right now. And I'm gonna go with his mom to Bambi Baby and we're gonna order my nursery furniture. I vlogged in my second trimester vlog um, when we went last time and picked out the furniture, but now we're finally gonna order it since we're closer to us moving in the house and there's Memorial Day sales. Um, so yeah, that's what we're gonna do. And I'm wearing the new set I got from Isla Movement feeling very pregnant this morning. <laughs> feel like my belly just like grew. Um, and just this Aritzia zip up sweatshirt and sneakers. Cause like I said, we're gonna go for a walk first and then we're gonna go to that store. Um, Matt's golfing today. So I'll probably try to do a workout when I get back. I just was like relaxing this morning. Hi cute girl. Ready for your walk? <laughs> Come on. <laughs> the double dresser, okay. the changing table, sure, and we wanted the nightstand, right? Night yeah. Stand. Okay. So and the conversion room. Okay, it's now almost two o'clock, and I'm procrastinating doing a workout so badly. I just feel so round today, and yeah, I've just been like chilling. But look at the different pink scubas. I feel like the lighting in here is very yellow, so it's probably not doing it justice, but that's velvet dust, that's strawberry milkshake, and that's the new meadow sweet pink, which I love. It's like a baby pink, and I think I like it better than strawberry milkshake, um, and I feel guilty having three shades of pink, but I just like can't resist the pink scubas. Okay, it's now actually five o'clock. It's a while later. I showered and just like literally laid in my bathroom for a while and then it was hair wash day. So I had to like blow dry my hair and everything and obviously that takes a million years. And now I'm gonna get a spray tan, which is why I'm looking like this. This is like my spray tan outfit. I'm really feeling so big today, but um, yeah, I wanna get a spray tan and then Matt's been golfing all day, which is why I've just been chilling and he's gonna come over later. And we're just going to order pizza, watch, watch Succession. My parents are away this weekend in Florida. So we have the house to ourselves and my brother and Paisley. So we're just going to be chilling. So I'm back for my spray tan. And I don't know if this is a craving or me just giving in because I'm pregnant. But I got a Wendy's uh, Frosty on the way. And like every day after dinner, I mean right now it's before dinner. But I like have been getting myself chocolate soft serve which is something I would normally want during the summer anyways, but I've just been like getting it literally every single day. So I don't know if that's a craving or me just like giving in, like I said, cause I'm pregnant and saying, like using that as an excuse, but I've been enjoying it. All right, Matt's here now, chicken parm hero, cocoa, gluten-free pizza, 
succession, finish editing my vlog. It's the rest of the night. Right now we're getting King Kong. I didn't even tell Matt that I got a Wendy's Frosty today. <laughs> Cause I wanted to come here. <laughs> okay, it's now the next day. It is Sunday and we're heading into the city. We are gonna go to the Skims pop-up shop and then just kind of walk around and see where we end up and get dinner in the city. But I'm just wearing this dress from Aritzia. It's called the angel dress. I've been feeling very round since yesterday and like out of breath. Um, and then obviously I'm wearing sneakers since we're gonna be walking around. <laughs> daily soft serve <laughs> <laughs> so it's now the next day it's monday it's memorial day and um i'm just kind of like lazy this morning i did just go grocery shopping so i'll show you what i got and then i'm gonna try to get a workout in even though i'm really tired i think i just get really tired after days like yesterday where they're really long and then we're just gonna hang by the pool the rest of the day so pretty chill day um but the city was really fun it was a perfect day the Skims pop-up shop was really efficient. Like the line probably took 35 to 40 minutes, but it was very comfortable. They gave you water. Um, most of it was shaded and like, it wasn't like chaos or loud. It was like pretty chill. And then once you get in the store, it is very tiny. We were paired with like a personal shopper. So it was kind of awkward. He was like watching over my shoulder the whole time. So I couldn't really fail much in there. Um, but I did get a string bathing suit, which I will um try on today for when i go by the pool and yeah i don't know today is 23 weeks i think i just feel out of it because they say i think this is like when your fogginess starts like at the um grocery store like wegmans was all out of salsa so i went to whole foods and like to me it looked like they're out of salsa too and then i asked the guy there i was like are you out of salsa he's like oh it's right there i'm like Oh, it was right in front of me. Um, I don't know. I just feel out of it. And then it took like forever to get to the grocery store because every town was having a Memorial Day parade. And I just like couldn't get to where I needed to go. But um, yeah, so for my groceries, I've been eating dinner at Matt's house. His parents make dinner like every day um, and they always eat dinner together. So I'm pretty lucky I haven't been having to really buy or make dinner. Um, they're just like always wanting me over for dinner, which is so nice. And then for lunch, I kind of just like have yogurt and like snacks. Sometimes I'll have quesadillas, so I have cheese and tortillas on hand, but I don't know. Um, so for breakfast, usually I have like cereal or these bars. Um, I got chips and like salsa and guac to hang by the pool today. Some coffee, this for like when I'm craving some soda and then um, I've been craving a lot of lemonade. Actually, we'll talk about that in a second. I have gluten-free pretzels and then my yogurt I've been liking is like the light and fit strawberry cheesecake or these almond loco shibani flips. I still have my lemon water. I got some peaches and just some of these like squares. But yeah, like I said, I've been craving lemonade. I get a lot of lemonade. And um, yesterday Matt and I sat down at a Mexican restaurant in the city and he ordered a drink and I just ordered a lemonade. And when it came out, like the first sip, it tasted like there was alcohol in it. I mean, I don't know, it could have just been like margarita mix or something, but it definitely didn't taste like just your normal lemonade. So like I sent it back and he brought out a new one. He didn't really say, like confirm if there was alcohol in it or not. And like, I don't know if the taste was still in my mouth, but to me, it just like tasted off still. So I'm just like, I don't know, I'm pretty bummed. That was like just an unfortunate situation because we are having such a good day. And like, I didn't make a scene or anything, but I know it's just one sip, but I don't know, it's just scary. So I'm gonna put this away and try to get a workout in. 
So I'm trying on the lip gloss set from Lulu that I got on Friday and I'm just like debating about keeping it or not. Um, like I was gonna work out on it, but I don't know if it's worth keeping. Like I love the bra. I actually used, I, a long time ago, I got the Align Tank cropped or hemmed to this length because I really wanted an Align bra like this. It's just so flattering. So yeah, I really like the bra. I'm just not sure about the shorts. I don't know if it's because it's double lined. Like it's very comfortable. And it looks fine from the front, but then I just feel like the back is just like really unflattering. And again, I don't know if it's because it's double lined or what, like, um, I don't know, it's just like not doing anything for me. I don't know if it comes up just like too high back here and just like the double line just kind of like, I don't know, it's just not that flattering or I don't know if it's because I'm pregnant right now. So obviously my body's different, but it's hard because I don't know, like I feel like if I want to wear them when I'm not pregnant, the color won't be available anymore, so I don't know what to do. Okay, I definitely feel more comfortable in the black shorts, but it still like is cutting into my back now. I guess I'm just not used to that, so I just feel a little awk on the back, but at least the black is not as like, you know, is thinner here than the double lined, so I probably will return the double lined uh, shorts. Okay, workout is done. I'm really happy. I just did an upper body workout. My legs were way too tired from walking around the city yesterday. So now Matt's gonna come over. I'm just gonna chill by the pool. I put my skim swimsuit on and it is so tiny. I was like not sure about getting a large because I don't want it to be like too big, but oh my God, it's actually like so tiny. I'll just show you the top. I mean, obviously my boobs are larger right now from pregnancy, but even so, like I would want a large, it's very tiny. And then I got a small on the bottoms, which I think is good because the front comes very low, but the back, there's like plenty of fabric in the back. So I think getting a medium, it would be like too much fabric in the back. And obviously this is like adjustable. So the sides aren't an issue. And I think it's meant to go really low in the front. So yeah, this is definitely just a bikini to lounge with your husband. Um, I can't imagine like going in the ocean in this or something because yeah, it's very tiny, but I love this color and it's a great tanning bikini. Here she is. Hi. Hi. She didn't even see me. Uh, hi. Hi. You didn't see me. Is your chair? Oh, yeah. Oh, don't scratch me. <laughs> Matt wants me to get his dive. Let's see it. Looks good. Wow, it's cold. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, it's freezing. She didn't like that. Alright, come here. Hi. I would not do that again. <laughs> good girl. Okay, I'm gonna end the long weekend vlog here. I just showered and now I'm gonna go to Matt's for dinner tonight, but that was our Memorial Day weekend. So yeah, it was really nice to actually stay up here and not worry about going down the beach. It was like the perfect weekend. And, but that is it. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.